I guess one person can make a difference. Enough said. Hey folks, it's me, your TV pal, Comic Book Man. I'm back once again with your Ship Shape Update for November the 14th, 2018. This is our 1269th week of altering your reality. And when you stop off at your full-service comic book store alternate reality, this new Comic Wednesday at 7 a.m., 7 a.m., you'll find 295 brand new and some returning items on the racks and ready to go here at Alternate Reality. And of those 295 items, 192 are going to be brand new comics, and every single one of them will be 15% off all week long. That's a savings of $123 and one penny to you if you were to come down and buy them all. Now, you are probably not going to do that, but if you come down, you will get 15% off all those new comics. So a piece of that $123.01 pie is waiting for you down here. All you got to do is show up. Now, of all of the 192 books that are coming in this week, 13 of them are first issues. And, of course, we first day sale all of our first issues here at the store, which means they're 25% off on the first day they come out. First issue, first day it comes out, 25% off. That's a $15.22 savings to you if you were to come down and buy them all. Again, you may not do that, but there's only 13 of them, so there's a good chance you just might. But whether you do or not, 25% off is waiting for you down here. Come on down on New Comic Wednesday. Get your piece of that pie. Now, of all the 192 books that I mentioned that are coming in, 18 of them are considered all-ages titles. Good for kids from age 6 to 60. And our book of the week for this week, our all-ages book of the week for this week, is Minions Viva La Bas, number one. This is as a $3.99 cover price, but for you, this will be $2.99 or 25% off all week long here at the store because it's our kids' book of the week. The Minions go on a magical history tour history tour as they search out the perfect angel ge evil genius blah, 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 toy boat evil genius for them to serve who will they pick who will they find uh, they'll probably wind up with that bald guy from the movies but you know maybe not well we can never tell uh this book comes with two variant covers the one you're looking at here and this one both of which like i said 25 percent off all week long first issue don't miss out good for the entire family and now it's time for our top 10 list. As always, the top 10 list starts with number 10 at the bottom, works its way up to number 1 at the top. This list is based on my ordering here at Alternate Reality. If you go to another store, why would you do that if you live in the area? But if you go to another store, your numbers may vary. But for me, this is our top 10 list for Alternate Reality. And coming in at number 10 this week is... Oh, first issue, Black Order number 1 of 5. That's right, folks. You wind up in the in the last Avengers movie for the first time, you get your own book from Marvel. It's amazing. Uh, Five-issue miniseries, Thanos' world-killing generals have finally gotten their own book, and the Grand Master has given them an, made them an offer that they just can't refuse. What is it? You'll find out in this issue. Two variant covers, the one you're looking at here, and this one. Both of these, 25% off New Comic Wednesday, 15% off the rest of the week. Don't miss out. Coming in at number eight is... Or number nine, I'm sorry. Number nine is Venom number eight. The maker has figured out a way to bring Flash Thompson back to life. And that is something which Eddie Brock is not very happy with. Not because of any sort of any sort of reason for of of of, of feeling jealous of him or anything. No, it's because Flash has earned his rest and he ought to give it to him. But anyway, uh, this book has got two variant covers, the one you're looking at here. And, oh, look, it's still X-Men Month at Marvel. X-Men variant cover. Like I said, both of these 15% off all week long. Coming in at number eight. Captain America, number five. Winter in America, part five. Cap versus the Taskmaster. And Tap, Cap versus Madam Hydra. And all of them getting a tussle in order to save, or at least Cap's trying to save, Sharon Carter. And what about the Red Skull? You'll find out in this issue. Uh, comes with two variant covers, the one you're looking at, and X-Men variant cover, both of which 15% off all week long. Coming in at number seven. Thor number seven. This is Young Thor's Lament. It, I'm not sure if there's a multi-part storyline. It sort of ends open-ended, so it might continue into the next issue. Uh, but this is a tale of Young Thor back when he was a teenager, back when he was a callow youth, and one of his trips to Midgard. And this explains maybe possibly the reason why Thor is so enamored with Mid Midgard and why Odin is so pissed off at him all the time for being so enamored with Midgard. Oh, and Loki's got something to do with it, too. Uh, two variant covers, the one you're looking at here, and another X-Men cover, 15% off all week long. Number six is... Detective Comics number 992, coming up on that thousand. Um, the face to face part five. Bats 
Two-Face and the Outsiders trash the Natural History Museum in Gotham, fighting Cobra and his crew, because Cobra has something that's worse than anthrax that he's going to unleash on the population. This book, two variant covers, as always, with DC Books. The one you're looking at here, and this beautiful Batman poster cover, which DC will never make a poster out of. Both of them 15% off all week long. Coming in at number five, Superman number five. <laughs> Unity Saga, part five. <laughs> there, 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 there's, there's a whole theme going on here. Uh, the Houses of Krypton are reunited. The House of Zod, House of El, and the House of Kandor, they're all reunited. The Atom shrinks the Earth. And you know what? Tests are hard. And Kale is reminded of this by Mon Pa Kent. Uh, this book has two variant covers, the one you're looking at here. And it, it's, not it's not exactly a poster cover, because you can see the Superman logo in the background. But it's damn close. And yes... It still tickles 15% off all week long. Coming in at number four, Fantastic Four. Number three, I think there's a theme here. Uh, family Reunion. The FF family, which means not just the Fantastic Four, not just the Future Foundation, but every single person who's ever been a member of the Fantastic Four in any way, shape, or form show up in this issue in order to help defend Franklin from, from the one and only Griever. Uh, this book comes with two variant covers, the one you're looking at here. And, oh, look at that. It's a, it's a Battle Lines cover featuring the She-Hulk, who was a member of the FF once upon a time. Uh, ask, ask John Byrne if you'll believe me. 15% off all week long. Coming in at number three is Amazing Spidey number nine, Heist Part 2. Spidey and the Black Cat check out the Thieves Guild while MJ visits Jarvis at the Avengers Mansion and has herself a Heroes in Crisis sort of moment. And if you don't know what Heroes in Crisis is, read more DCs! This book comes with three, count them, three variant covers. The one you're looking at here, which is a standard cover. The X-Men cover and this beautiful Black Cat Spidey cover, uh, all of which will be 15% off all supplies last all week long here at the store. Coming in at number two, these are the two big ones for this week, folks. This is not the book of the week, but in any other normal week it would have been. Avengers number 10. This is the 700th anniversary issue of the Avengers. You have the Soviet super soldiers returning to fight the Defenders of the Deep, which are being uh, pursued by the Squadron Supreme of America. That's right, the Squadron Supreme of America. They finally threw the of America in there. And if you don't know what I mean, you don't know your Squadron Supreme history and who the hell they're supposed to be. This book has not one, not two, not three, but four, four standard varying covers. The one you're looking at here, this beautiful Finch cover. That's right, Finch, he's back at Marvel. This, uh, this, uh, oh, who did this one? Uh, Ron Lim. This Ron Lim cover. And, oh, look at that. Alan Davis cover. I love Alan Davis. Um, this is, and by the way, even though this is Avengers 700, X Men variant cover. Anyway, this book is going to be 15% off all week long. It has a five, five ninety nine, six ninety nine. excuse me for a moment. It has a five ninety nine dollars cover price. And like I said, it'll be 15% off all week long. Stop on down. Don't miss it. That would have been our book of the week. But instead, our book of the week for this week is Uncanny X-Men number one, disassembled number one of ten. This is the new weekly series for ten issues, uh, which means it's coming out every week. Number two is coming out next week uh, for the Uncanny X-Men. It reshuffles the deck on the X-Men. Uh, it's basically Avengers disassembled for the X-Men. Um, they have come up with a new vaccine called the Vaccine vaccine and they it's an injection that they give to all children just before puberty in school you know sort of like you know any other injection that you'd get for mumps or measles or or, or tuberculosis or anything else it's given to all the kids at school and what does it do it completely eradicates the x gene before you hit puberty and whether you have it or not every kid gets it matter of course totally going to eradicate the x gene do you think the x-men have a problem with that maybe <laughs> And what part does a multiple man have to play with it in this? If you got the multiple man miniseries, you're going to be ahead of the game on everyone else. This book comes not with one, not with two, not with three, not with four, but with five, five varying covers. This one you're looking at here. I'm just going to flip through them here real fast. This one, Dave Cockrum. Oh, this is, this is, this is a Dave Cockrum wraparound cover. Oh, look at that. That is beautiful. This one, which is Rob Liefeld, which is Rob Liefeld, and this one, all of which will be 
25% off all week long because that is our book of the week for this week. This book has a wonderful $7.99 cover price, but it's 25% off all week long at the here at the store, which I think means it's $7.99 or uh, $5.99. I'm not sure about that. Uh, I don't have the numbers in front of me, but it's 25% off all week long while supplies last. Stop on down. Don't miss out. Uncanny X-Men number one is a weekly book. This is the week to get in on the ground floor. And now it's time for the store's calendar. Congratulations, Gauthier Rifle Mania winner number 220. Grace from Oak Lawn. She won herself a G.I. Joe number one Williams 1 in 10 variant set. Congratulations, Grace. We hope that you enjoy the adventures of G.I. Joe, G.I. Joe, fighting man from head to toe on the land, on the sea, in the air. Uh, the November here of the month is still the X-Men. All month long, all my X-Men trade paperbacks will be 25% off because of the uncanny x-men there's a reason i pick these every month and this month's is because of the uncanny x-men number one which is the beginning of the weekly series so x-men is our book of the is our hero of the month for this month so like i said all my x-men trades 25 percent off all month long don't miss out friday night magic is going to be this friday at 7 p.m november 16th stop on down for that saturday is going to be our saturday showdown which starts at 11 a.m that's uh saturday november the 17th don't miss out on either one of those this Thursday is our Lady Day sale. Ladies, stop by the store on November 15th all day long and save 20% off all your purchases. Just walk in the door, whatever you buy, 20% off because Thursday is Ladies Day at Alternate Reality. Uh, the big news for this week, though, is the Gobbledygooker sale begins Saturday the 17th, which is also Local Comic Shop Day, which is the reason why we're starting Gobbledygooker sale on Local Comic Shop Day. Uh, as always, Gobbledygooker Sale is one of my four celebrations I do throughout the year. They're tied in with each of the seasons. Gobbledygooker is the fall one. Uh, it's always Thanksgiving week. The next one after this will be Winter Wonderland, which is sometime in February. It's always weather dependent. One after that is Free Comic Book Day, uh, which is always tied in with Free Comic Book Day, first Saturday in May. And, of course, the store anniversary sale, which is always tied in somewhere around August the 20th, which is our store anniversary. But Gobbledygooker is this week. It starts on Saturday. Everything in the store will be 20% off. All my box back issues will be 50% off. That's going to be not for one, two, seven, ten days, eleven days, eleven days from uh, local comic shop day through Giving Tuesday. Uh, so stop on down. Don't miss out. We're going to have Black Friday in there. I will get to my Black Friday sale next week with next week's shipping. Uh, but the Black Friday sale will be in there. Uh, the Black Friday sale is we take a break from Gobbledygooker because the discounts are even better. But we take a break from Gobbledygooker for Black Friday, and then we go back to it until Giving Thursday. Uh, Giving Tuesday, I'm sorry. Uh, also, uh, Alternate Reality Podcast number 91 is finally up. It's the James Bond episode, Shake It Not Stirred. It's our James Bond 007 show. Don't miss that. It, it's it's JR or it's Bo, myself, and Rod Flash talking about uh, the one and only legacy of James Bond. And of course, number 90 is still up there. It's an all news update. And that's going to do it for me. Be sure to go to the store's website, myalternatereality.com, to find out more about everything that I've mentioned here today, as well as Vito Carly's reviews, as well as good old JR's reviews, and much, much more, myalternatereality.com. And thank you all for watching the show, watching this uh, video cast. Please like, share, and subscribe it. I would appreciate that. Get it around out there. And uh, remember, if you don't like your reality, alter it at Alternate Reality. And until next time, this is Comic Book Man saying, Bye! Show you how to and when will you be then? You belong, you belong, you belong, you belong to the Merry Marble Marching Society. March along, march along, march along to the song of the Merry Marble Marching Society. If you growl, if you groan, with the dour sour of the gift, you howl, if you moan, you can lose your sour but the keep me trim and in step with the thin. Of the very marble marching society. Be an early riser. Strive to be ambitious. Speak a little wiser. Try to be judicious. Be a good advisor. Never
never ever vicious. And where will you be then? Face front! Lift your head! Superhero marching right along through the fighting songs of the men. 